Hi, in this video I'm going to demonstrate how to out sort output from your Azure searches using ASP.NET MVC6. I currently have a connection to an Azure database built using ASP.NET MVC6 and C Sharp. I'm going to add default sort and I'm going to add a sortable column onto this. Alright, so currently project looks like this. I can search up here and that I did in a different video. Go back to full list. Um, you currently see that they're not sorted by anything. If you want to drive a user nuts, give them output that isn't sorted because you know they can't find anything. Um, so I'm going to get title to sort by default and then I'm going to make type sortable if I click on the link at the top. Okay, start by getting the search. I sort. Okay, very simply, you can just do it like this. I'm going to do it after my search, because you, know, you always want to sort on smaller things and bigger things. So that simple line there will force the sort by the f here on the clients. Um, you can argue all day whether you should sort on the server or sort in the client. Both are good. Sorting on the client, like I just did here, Saves if saves work in your server, and if you have a small amount of data, it's not going to be a problem. If you have a large amount of data, sort it on your server because it's got more CPU power than your client likely has. So I click on books, go to, and look, they are clearly in alphabetic order. All right, so now what I want to do is I want to handle this idea of being able to sort by multiple things, not just by title. So in order to do that, I got to create some setups. So I'm going to go to my index page. And we'll put links around these. Oops. All right, so I'm going to put an A. What am I doing? A href. This is not HTML. This is ASP. I'm going to use ASP sort order. It doesn't drop, but it's there. And I'm going to read something out of view data that I'm going to build here in a couple minutes. I'm going to do the same thing for type. And I could do the same thing for paperback, publisher code, all that good stuff. If I do too, you guys can figure out how to do the rest. Ed to format it. Okay, this will be type format, type instead of title. All right, so when I click on title, it's going to take me to index, and this sort order is going to get passed back into a new parameter that I need to create. Um, this parameter is going to put it at the very top, and I already put it here. I put string sort order. Um, search string I put in my previous video. If you don't have anything there, that's fine. Just add sort order. Um, It'll work even if you do nothing at this point. That sort order will be ignored. So I'm going to get rid of this line. And I'm going to have to deal with the parameter I'm passing back and forth. So I'm going to enter a couple weird lines of code. I'm going to build a switch. So I'm going to build those view datas. So I'm using the ternary operator here. And essentially I'm saying set title sort parameter to title sort if it's null or empty, or if it just holds title sort. Do the same thing for type sort. This is kind of like waving my hands here. This code just almost is magical. This is asking that I click type. If so, set sort order to type sort. And also set it to type sort. I had to end this in as a just a bug fix. I had some really weird glitches going on, and that making the true and false value of the ternary just simply made it work. Okay, so I'm gonna use title sort and type sort in my switch.
So I'm going to set so the title sort into defaults. I'm going to have them sort, which is this line. And then I'm going to use type sort. Except let's sort by type. So clearly you can see that no matter which sort I pick, uh, it'll run either by title, sort by type. If I don't pick anything, it'll default to sort by title, which is how I like it. Um, again, I sort it after my search because you always want to sort a smaller list. It makes it faster. Let's run it and see what happens. Okay, books. Should still be sorted by title. It is. I click on type. They're grouped. Title. The only thing that doesn't work real well right now, if I do a search, it sorts by title by default. If I try to subsort it, it takes me back. That's a glitch. And that's a solvable glitch. And I'll let you guys figure that out. All right. Thank you for watching. Um, in this video, you learned how to do simple sorting in ASP.NET MVC6. Thanks and good luck.